Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Shirley, if you're new here, and if you are new, welcome to the channel. In today's video, I'm gonna be reviewing Mish Indulge Moisturizing Deep Conditioner. Cause it's been um, three weeks since I condi deep conditioned my hair, so I feel like it's time. And this is from my last year's stash. I want to try to get rid of, use up my stash, my old stash before I start on the new stash. But I did use the Anish, Anashi one. But I said, you know what? You better use up all this old stuff because if you use up all the... Hey guys, before I get to that, do y'all remember this style from the 90s? You would have a bun in the back and then this here swoop side my friend used to did she did not like that style she would say i can't it looked like your face is divided in two she didn't like it but anyway i was saying i wish i can not wish i want to use up my old stash before i dive into my new stash because then the old stash really will get to a point i'm gonna have to throw it away like i did not use this one then i was in there counting my deep conditioners Cause I didn't want to get any more this year because I had enough. Cha! I got like 10 bottles. So it's creamy. I know this might not be new to other people, but it's new to me. I didn't get a chance to try it. My hair is soaking wet, so water is dripping on me. I think I better read and see what high she say use it. Cause she love for you to use a lot of water with her stuff. Let me see. She always say, water, water, water. A lot of it. Indulge is an intense, super moisturizing deep conditioner for all hair type, especially dry, damaged hair. Especially dry, damaged, and color-treated hair. Dulge make hair more manageable, soft, and healthier which enables hair to retain length and growth indulge deep conditioner is enriched with raw honey a humectant which helps attract moisture to hair simple simple but effective ingredients such as olive oil and babasso oil helps nourish and heal hair in need of repair that's neat i never read it before wait well, don't tell you how to use so surely get to use it how she want probably is on the bigger jar but i got this last year and didn't get a chance to use it so and i think a lot of these natural products really don't have that long of a shelf life on it to me i was thinking unless they put a really good preservative in it and some people don't want preservative but it gotta have something in it because i was listening to curly chemistry and she was talking about you have to put especially if water is the first ingredient there have to be a, a stronger um preservative just than just peppermint and other oils you need to get a stronger one to keep it to give it shelf life let me show y'all what i shampooed with she don't even say how long i can i'm gonna do 30 minutes though i'm gonna really sit up on a, a hot cap for 30 minutes because i didn't condition my hair I had leave-in and stuff like that but I didn't deep condition my hair in three weeks and let me show you guys what I used and then I'll tell you why I didn't condition it for three weeks I didn't even use the rinse out so I just had my hair and then I reapply leave-in conditioner and water and did a twist out and call it a day and I'm gonna tell you why I shampooed my hair with the Curly Temple by Main Crush Cleanse. 
cleanse and remove product buildup with without stripping. And what I, like I was saying, this is my last year. Black Friday haul. I'm planning on using all of it this weekend because I'm going to do some some family hairs with it. I don't like combing it. This condition off. Do we? Well. I love the smell of it. Her stuff smells good to me, too. I haven't even... Her shampoo with this is just like normal shampoo to me. So, I, I haven't even tried anything I don't like of hers. I like niche product. I didn't try the pumpkin thing she came out with. But I do have the new line that she came out last year with to try this year. My hair feel moisturized, which is just sitting in here with me just putting it on now it feels soft i like it i like the feel of this now i love the scent of it so we're gonna give it a nine for the scent and why i like scented stuff when i wash my hair i don't like my hair to smell like nothing i don't like it to smell like nothing i like it to be pretty i like it when i put my hand on my scalp I don't smell it, but if I do like this, it don't smell like sweat or body odor. <laughs> so that's why I like a scented product. But I, like I was saying, I didn't, I haven't deep conditioned my hair because I was sick. She was sick. I think I mentioned it. It's the video coming on after this though. In my makeup video but yeah on this channel i do makeup simple easy makeup that you can wear to work you it's a everyday wear makeup because i wear makeup every day <laughs> every day and i do my natural hair i want to start doing a little bit more vlogging and i want to go and do a live i got some things for the live i think i'm gonna do a haul like unboxing some stuff I got that I have sitting over to the side that I want to do in my live stream. So I'm getting ready to do that. But like I said, I was sick. After Christmas, um, my daughter returned to work for like three days, but I was on vacation during the Christmas holiday. I didn't go back to work until 2022. But my daughter was off and she went to work and then there was uh, there was this guy at work you have to be suspicious of people she said he was in the hot coughing and sneezing but he said to her oh i know it's not because i have the test now i test myself and it's negative and I don't have it. And then she was like, she said, I had my mask on. And I was like, okay, guys, because she wasn't coming back to the next year. I'll see you guys next year, blah, blah, blah. And he said, hey, Brindell, <laughs> I got so many of these that my wife brought. You should take them and in case you need them because I just have so many. So I'm giving them out to everybody just to give them to them. Because it's a shortage. So she said she took that. And then she came home. Oh, this feels so good on my hair. I love it. She came home and I hung out with her. And we don't wear masks around each other. Because we wear masks out with everybody else. And she said she still don't know how. That she got it because she said i had my mask on the whole time but like i said people be sneezing and coughing and you walk through or it got on her hands or somewhere it got on her and she got it and then i got it but i give god the glory and the praise child I'm a diabetic, as I said in one of my videos, and I'm going to talk about the fasting in another one, but I'm a diabetic. So when I discovered that I had it, I was so 
scared that my diabetes is just gonna go off the change. It either gonna go up too high, because if it get too high, you can go into a coma, or if it get too low, you can go into a coma. And I was like, I was scared that I don't know what it's going to do. I said, Lord, I put my life into your hand. You go inside these organs and you protect me from this virus because I did everything I was supposed to do. I wore my mask. I got vaccine. I got fully vaccine. I have the booster. I have everything, Lord. So now I'm relying on you to shield and protect me through this. Let me tell you guys something. I did not, I cough, I had a cough, I was sneezing, and I had a runny nose. I only coughed at night, like when I went to sleep, I would cough, and I would sneeze every now and then. My nose ran for like a day, and then after two days of runny nose, sneezing and coughing, and a slight fever, it got up to like 101, I, the symptoms went away. I am so grateful that I did not get sick, sick. Besides the running nose and the coughing and the sneezing, but the coughing was like this. <coughs> and two or three hours ago, and I didn't cough. Now I go, <coughs> it wasn't like, <coughs> and like people tell me that they be coughing so much they can't breathe. They be feeling like they're going to pass out because they can't breathe. I didn't have shortness of breath. My oxygen stayed up to 98, 99, 100. My blood pressure was in check. The diabetes stayed normal. <laughs> Cha! Now you know that was God. So I give God the honor and the glory. I did not get sick from this. And I'm so grateful for that. So guys, I'm going to go put the rest of this conditioner on my hair. And then I'm going to go rinse it out. And I'll come back and give you my final thought on this conditioner i've used that much it's so white that much so far so guys i am back after rinsing out the mish indulge moisturizing deep conditioner my hair is soft and i feel like it did moisturize it and as you can see, the curls are defined and I haven't even put anything on my hair. And my hair feels good. It just feels good. I feel like my hair is hydrated and it's soft. Not over soft though. Just nice soft, but not over not squishy, because the hair feels strong too. I think I almost leave the conditioner on too long. I, I stayed up under the hot hat for 30 minutes and then I rinsed it out. But I have a, I don't know, when conditioner, deep conditioners stay on my scalp too long, it just feel tender. But let's take a look at the back. I think it's a really nice conditioner. But I like her stuff. I think I like the other one a little better. The one with the protein in it. I think my hair like that one better. But this is good. Look. Okay, guys. I want to thank you for stopping by and watching my video. And if you're new here and just became a part of the family, welcome to the family. And I will see you in my next upload. And be safe out there in these streets. Mwah, mwah.